Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 39 of Let's Play Dark Cloud 2. Alright, we're gonna get ourselves another monster badge, and we have to get it from the Spider Lady. So you gotta give her a gift box that has three gold bars. Yeah, so that's up to 3,000 Gildo worth to get that particular badge for Darklings. Now, as much as I like to uh, get another badge that you can get in the Rainbow Butterfly Wood, I don't have any more gift boxes. So we're just gonna have to leave that alone. I might come back here when I get more gift boxes. And I know where I can get them, too. Let's exit the dungeon, because we don't need to be there anymore. At least not for now. So I believe we got to head to Mount Gundor again to put this new time bomb to good use. Now, before you do this, make sure you've taken a picture of the cinder first. Otherwise, you'll miss out on it. That's it! So that's what's causing our fiery rain problem. Let's hurry up and destroy it. All right! It causes problems, therefore we need to get rid of it. That's how it works in our world. Fire Squall! That's another scoop. Where's our level again? Let me take a look. Oh, I'm level 6, and my score is 588! That's pretty high for this point in the game. But yeah, let's just make a few things while we're here. The uh, Fire Squall is already going to get some use. So we'll need a geyser. And we'll get a tree. And that Fire Squall, let's use that now. I was not in the invent menu, was I? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Now I gotta select them all again. Well, I'm an idiot. Should have been paying attention. Again, geyser, tree, and fire squall. Nothing to do with that uh, emo guy from Final Fantasy VIII. Yeah, it works! He's not made out of fire. Mostly hot air. <laughs> Moving on. We'll need an air cleaner. A barrel. And we'll get the power... Power squall. Fire squall again. See, I told you it will be used for a lot of things here. Or at least on the early things. Say cheese! Barrel Cannon 4. I think that's the best Barrel Cannon in the whole game. I don't know if there is like a version 5. 4 seems pretty high, all things considered. Okay, let's use the paints. A power arm. And Clown Robo's attack. It works! Good stuff. Good stuff. Right, next up, let's use an energy pipe. And I will use the generator. And last, some pot. Not that kind of pot. Yeah, it works! Energy pack. Urn edition. So now you can carry your granny's ashes with you in a battle. <laughs> Don't do that, by the way. Don't go in a battle. <laughs> Runaway dragon. I will need. What else? A weapon. 
and the work crane, and I, yes, I do have it. Say cheese! Now we got Samurai Arm 2. Okay, that's gonna be enough for now. I guess I have to go up these ramps to use the, uh, time bomb? Yeah, let's go use that. At least they put ramps there for us. The Fire Squall. For some reason, here is all one word. the fire rain problem flying battleship death arc Ooh. look who decided to show up Gaspar so you wiped out the fire squall pungent little devils now it's time for you to die! You were gonna kill us anyway. Or try to. He's attacking! It's no use. My magic won't reach at this distance. Max, use your right pod. See if this works. Oh, luckily it's not that far. Well, this Nova Cannon is not very strong. Whoa! It got destroyed in one hit? Well, I guess I'm switching to Max for now. Okay, there we go. We had to use up all the skill points that Cedric had. And he's like one shot from that cannon. Does that much damage. Let me go make a new body for it. So it looks like this body is not handling it very well. We'll have to go with a super alloy body, which I don't have enough uh, silver balls to do. Maybe a refrigerator body? Would that be better? I like how we're able to just do this, like, in the middle of a fight. Why is that 18? Now it's at 22! So this is actually better. I feel like the propeller is not really going to do me any favors. So let me switch it up back to the multi beat Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. I wonder if I have enough to make the uh, barrel cannon more. Okay, I need rolling logs and gunpowder, as well as a bullseye coin. Nova Cannon's only level 1, so I guess we will go with the, uh, 
There it is. Is it even reaching? I don't think it's reaching. Now I gotta fuel up again. Oh yeah, it is reaching. It just takes a while to get there. But it's getting there. There, we did it. That was rough. Rougher than I expected. Damn you, you little brats. Just how did you? Gaspard, you won't slither away from me this time. I can jump down, it's all right, is it? <laughs> um, where do I go now? Where did I come from? I'm gonna go this way. It looks like the other way is where I started. Ooh, is she okay? I, I hope she lived. <laughs> It's gonna be hard to do this on my own. Guess I gotta like run across all this. Seems to be a lot of invisible walls for some reason. I see no way down. Maybe other than just go down here? There's an arch. Usually arches lead somewhere. God, you can't even see the bottom. Advance to next floor. Walking the path of flames. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. I'm not gonna have Monica for a while. I don't know how I feel about this. I really don't. But let me go back to... Uh, I think after that battle, I'm going to have to take some drastic action. Well, I don't know if you can call it drastic action. I'm going to take action that's positive. First things first, I need to dismiss you because you have zero skill points now. There, repair the ride pod. Upgrade the ride pod. And I'm thinking the best thing to do... Load up on shield kits. Which, sadly, I can only buy one. The rest of this stuff is not very helpful. Did I try to make the other energy pack? Oh yeah, I need sticky clay for this. Just add you back. Plain and simple. Well, I hardly ever use your skills anyway, except for drastic emergencies. So I think it was sticky clay that I needed to get. Let me go see Conda. 
Yeah, the train is looking pretty empty now, now that I migrated a lot of people to the towns. Okay, sticky clay, sticky clay. There it is. Alright, I like to put myself in a sticky situation, pun intended. Alright, well, I'm really glad I got the best core in the game. So I can just pack up on a lot of things. Energy earn. Um, there, that's a little bit better. Let me just go to like a random uh, person because there'll be lots of shops. I'm gonna need to get rid of some crap. Which means I should probably talk to you, Dad. This is probably not useful anymore. And I'm likely not going to use this for anything. So get rid of that. I got a level 4, so I don't need a level 3. Most of this stuff don't seem as bad. Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of this, too. Freed up some inventory space. Let's head back to Mount Gundor. Hopefully Monica is alright. It's gonna suck not having her around for extra help. It looks like her inventory just got added to the pools, like the inventory pool. Well, that was helpful! <laughs> Just right next to the Geostone, are you kidding me? Oh god, bats, really? They poison as well. I gotta get some more ride pod fuel as well. How the hell am I locking onto this one? Lava Golem! Nothing like the one in Yu-Gi-Oh! Usually that one has a cage! And a bunch of skulls, for some reason. Doesn't look like there's a... a lot of, uh, map on this floor. Damn it! One bite and I'm poisoned again! It just swoops in there. Oh, poison! What the hell is this? Looks like a, a Chimera or a Manticore. God, there's like... Was there like three golems, or was there only two? It just felt like there was three. Ah, Chimera is his name. Pretty resilient too, I just noticed. I got the rope! Wait, is that a new, um, dungeon or floor key? I think it is. God, I'm surprised they actually give you a completely different key. But here we are. Uh, let me open this chest. What the hell is that? 
Alexander? Well, there was certainly nothing great about that, Alexander. Ayo! Or that. Looks so goofy with a helmet. Alright, that's pretty much all I'm going to look at on this floor. Let's move on. Again, like from last episode, to keep things moving really well, we'll just clear out as many as enough to like get the key and whatever. And then we will move on. Strangely enough, I have to use rope this time. Definitely don't want to get rope burn in a volcano. Burning undead. Okay, so I guess we're going to be dealing with zombies or more skeletons again. Let me get my camera ready in case I need to. Okay, well, doesn't look intimidating so far. And already we got the magic crystal. Geostone's over that way. Let's go get that. Probably gonna run into some new enemies, which is a good thing. Let me try this way instead. Lava runner! Oh, not another one of those in the masks. What the hell? Bone Lord! That's its name. Let me get rid of these lava runners first. Before I deal with that bone lord. Oh, there's the rope. <laughs> Did he just trip right away? A loser. Ultrasonic bomb? But it doesn't even explode. So it's a terrible bomb. Okay, so I think to get a scoop, I'm gonna have to make that Bone Lord dizzy. I gotta be careful that it doesn't knock this boulder off my hands. Like it just did! Oh, that sucks. What do I have that can just knock him out? Now, just a regular rock. Can't lift this monster. Not with that attitude, you're not. <laughs> it's gonna be hard to like wait wind vase, whatever the hell that is. What the hell is a white wind vase? I've never seen anything like that before. Oh, that's probably the uh, sub four key. Hope this bone lord doesn't screw things up again. There we go. Got the scoop that I need. So now this thing can just re die. Okay, now let's get that geostone and let's get out. a bit annoying to get that scoop because my first attempt failed. Yeah, let's let Steve deal with these. 
Yeah, look at my capacity now. 240. This is pretty good. Not gonna lie. Now let's press onward. I'm gonna go this way. There's more of these already? I've dealt with two of you before. Now there's another one. I felt like given that it uses energy waves, I don't know why it's not called ultrasonic boom. Ultrasonic bomb. I'll just blow on some lava and cool it. You can't even blow into a hot pocket to cool it, but yet you can blow on lava. This game has no realism whatsoever. That map is not gonna matter anymore. Cause I'm gone. I'm Balin. Balin Smithers. <laughs> Balin Sminkers. <laughs> much more of this dungeon I have to do. It shouldn't be that much longer. And at least now that when I go in there with the uh, Georama, I don't have to worry about that fire rain anymore. So if I want to make straw houses, I could. I selected the wrong item. Yeah, I'll just climb down using this stove. I meant to select the rope, which is one space above it. <laughs> oh wow, there's only this much of the dungeon left. Oh, there's a seal on this one? Sure, we'll do one more floor. I bet you'll have to help out more of the future before I can get to the end of it. I'm gonna remove this seal. It would be for the best for all of us. Especially me. The one who has to play this game. Something's coming. Oh, that's a dragon. Didn't even get a chance to fight back. What a loser. I've dealt with many a dragon in my Final Fantasy days. Which is funny because I'm doing FF9. I'm pretty sure, like... Compare it to like when these episodes are up, that I'm still doing FF9 at this point in the Let's Play. At least I like to think I am. Wow. These guys have a lot of HP. Big boys, but yet they can't do anything to me. When I block, <laughs> it's all them fruits of Eden, I'm telling ya. The fruit of Eden a day keeps the chimeras away. Yeah! Although I really wanted the weapon HP more than the health. I'll take what I can get. Gonna be easy, lost half of something. 
Like, you can lose what, half of your weapon HP and half of your health. Can you lose, like, anything else? I know you can get an ABS bonus. Can you actually lose ABS? Okay, so the feathers can hit you. Good to know, I guess. Oh, I got the bomber head boom! <laughs> it's a very terrible picture, but hey, I'm not playing Pokemon Snap. I didn't have to get a den in the middle. It just had to be there. Gooks and Baskin, Baskin Robbins. <laughs> I remember, like, years ago, this city actually had a Baskin Robbins. Of course, it's no longer there. But it was alright for what it was. Oh, a chopper. Good to the chopper! <laughs> or get a chopper. Did I get the rope? I don't remember if I did. I'm gonna probably turn up somewhere if I don't have it. It's likely gonna mean fighting those dragons. I do not have it. Okay. Neither did you! Definitely not. <laughs> Just the way I like it. I'm gonna try this way first. You know, I'm an inventor. Why can't I just invent rope? I'll just climb down with some hay and stuff. Just keep it wet with some holy water so that it doesn't dry up. That'll work, right? I'll just MacGyver my way out of this volcano. Pretty sure I got the Geo still, did I? Yeah, I did. Yeah, because it's not on this floor, or that room. Guess you'll just have to believe me when I say I got it. I like how you can get that goal even if you don't take everything out. Okay, yeah, I did get it. Wait, it says the seal's still there. Oh, do I actually have to beat this floor with the seal intact in order for me to have the seal removed permanently? Treasure chest, danger zone. I think that's what I need to do. Beat the uh, floor even with the seal intact. Monica, we're here to enjoy all this, am I right? Gundorada workshop restored. Cedric resigns in Hydrada. Item shop restored. Weapon shop restored. Eric and house near windmill. Operations room restored. I don't have an operations room. Okay, so we still need to find out the other condition for the operations room. Which we don't have. Okay. I'm thinking about this as we go. I don't even have 100 culture points yet. I only got 71. Let's see. Eric's house. I'm gonna start placing some shit down. 
But it looks like now I can even make freaking trees. If I so choose. to have. You know, you guys like laundry. Put some lamps down and everything. I can't put it on the windmill, unfortunately. There we go. Get two sets of lamps. We'll get one as well. Culture is now finally at 80. So I guess that's close to a condition. That brick house over there may not even be used. I wonder... Would Gerald rather an iron house? Cause he didn't like the brick house. Done, so iron might actually be great. Yep, he likes an iron house. And there's been a change in the future. Where's my culture at now? 101! Holy shit, we made it! We in there getting lots of stacks of points. Okay, let's go to the future now. Wait a minute. How the hell do I get back? That's right, I don't have Monica with me. What's that? That is called a building. There's something there. I'll check it out. Like there's a big building on the third floor. Let's scour the second floor first. The only reason I'm looking to do that is because, well, we did accomplish a lot. So maybe a lot more things appeared. Just wish I knew where. I doubt there's going to be anything on the first floor anymore. That looks to be cleared out. Yeah, everything's looking a lot better. I'll, I'll be mad if I just get witch parfaits. I got nobody to eat them. Well, there's a fruit of Eden. Of eaten, am I right? Well, until I get Monica, I'm just gonna hold on to these. Who knows? I might give them to her instead. I don't want Max to get too far ahead in health. She could use it too.
Now I actually made it back to the other side. So yeah, it's coming along. Don't think there's any point to talk to anyone else. Just wish each floor wasn't so big. Because it makes going like through my usual scouring. It's gonna take a long time. Which is a little frustrating, but not terrible. Just could be made a little bit better. But that's just my opinion. Elevator is not far from here. So yeah, let's go to the third floor. Yeah, let's go check it out. Oh good, I was right next to him. It had to be a witch parfait. It had to be a witch freaking parfait. Like, here is what you could have consumed. Oh, that's just there to be a tease. Like, why would you do that? Just why? That's what I was looking for. Another fruit of Eden. Okay, you know what? Let's go up here now. What's been going on this whole time? I just can't seem to remember, you know? That's okay, you used to not exist. Don't worry about it, it's fine. That's a big pipe. Maximilian? Could you possibly be Elena's? Do you know my mother? So you are then. You have your mother's eyes. That's nice to hear. I'm Galen Nagaris. I've been leading the rebels against Griffin, but it looks like my own origin point has been erased somehow. and fell into the Mount Gunder volcano. I'm heading out to save her. Is that right? Then take this with you. Yeah, I I'll have no problem just carrying it with me. The bottom of Mount Gondor is a dangerous place with a flowing river of lava. The going gets very rough. Use that when flames block your path. The same flames will become your servants. You should be able to make your way across the lava. That's the legendary instrument, Firehorn. Oh man, I get to be lava, Moses. It's one of my land's greatest treasures. It will come in handy. Thanks. I'll do my best. Gaspard killed my friend, Raybrandt. Raybrandt was a noble king, and the mightiest of knights. But Gaspard defeated him. You mustn't underestimate him. King Raybrandt? Monica's father? That's right. 
I'm gonna make Gaspard pay. Don't worry. I know you can do it. The Atlamia chose you. Good luck. You got anything I can take a picture of? Computer. And, uh, ventilation. I think I already have a picture of ventilation. The propeller! And I was trying to take a picture of that before. Why did that not count? There, we got two more things. Check out the rest of the third floor. Make sure that I'm fully prepared. Don't leave anything to chance if you can help it. It's got an awful lot to go through still. But I do see a box. I'm gonna open it. Potato pie. Don't mind if I do. Why did I almost break into a southern accent, which could have been Australian? I don't know. I just do these things on instinct. It looks like this is pretty much all I can see. So with that, I think it's time to get out of here. Surely my red Alamillion will get me back to my time, will it? Every time I've went back to my own time, it's been Monica that's been on the forefront. And has been using her stone. Can Maxis do that too? If so, why even bother showing each character doing that? Seems a bit like posturing to me. Just at that moment, my Atlamelia shone blue. The blue light that reached to the past. Was Monica's Atlamelia lending mine its power? Okay, looks like that's how it's gonna work. This is Cedric to not even question this. Like, you work for me. How are you able to do this? Alright, there we go. Let's save. Oh boy, we're getting real deep into it now. Now that I got that fire horn, we should be able to finish that dungeon. So let's stop here, and in the next parts, we'll continue on with the mountain. See everyone.